Hi, I'm Monster1970. Today I'm going to be installing a replacement handlebar. Finally, on my 1987 Honda XL600R. Let's get started. I'm going to start by taking off the mirrors. And they look like they are a 15 millimeter. Almost. Must be a 17 millimeter. Yes. Now, I'm going to have to remove everything over here. Yeah, that'll work. A little stubby will work. Okay, got that loose. That seems to be coming loose. That's good. This screwdriver has saved me quite a bit. that Put that away five sixteenths kinda and I can't get into the bottom one Take off the push pull cable. Now we can get into the other bolt. Okay. I'm take this off. This is my replacement handlebar. SKU number 599134. This is a Pro Taper handlebar set. It is a 7 8 inch bar and it does fit in there. See how far it's bent back. See that? How far back that one is. Well, I've gotten these clamp on grips for my bike, and the part number is 5902436. I got these from Dennis Kirk. The left hand side fits well, no problems. Right hand side, I could not find a matching end because it comes with all these different fittings or all these different adapters which will just push right on here. Uh, this is the closest one I could find and there was nothing that matched it up in the instructions. I went and picked this up from Action Motorsports Part number 02036. And then I've got some glue 176130. And I'm going to be reusing the old tube. So I'm going to try to get some of this glue off of here. Because I think it might be why it was sticking before. I got most of the glue off of this. 
Hopefully it's enough. I can uh, get it to work on there without sticking. There are two 10 millimeters that hold the seat on. Let me take them off. Now that they're out, I'll be able to lift the seat off. There's an eight millimeter bolt that holds the tank on. Grab a little Loctite on that. Good. And then this should lift off. Should lift up and back. Looks like the other side's going to be the push pull cables. And they're back down about as far as I can get them. So, what I'm going to do is try to take one of them out. Or maybe both. Give me enough room. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start on my left hand side and I'm going to start adjusting everything here. Good. I'm gonna put that other rubber grip. Well, I went and I torqued everything back down. Got the handlebars all torqued in place. Got the mirrors adjusted and all the controls and the grips. I'm waiting for that one to dry a little bit. This grip is working good. And I got the headlight back in and it is working. Battery needs a charge because it's been sitting for a while and went dead. But other than that, everything seems to be good. If you have any questions about anything, um, make sure you put something in the comments. Well, that'll do it for installing replacement handlebars and grips on my 1987 Honda XL600R. I hope you like this video. Please like, share, and subscribe, and stay safe.